going on my friend welcome to the channel almost happy thanksgiving right how you guys doing doing fantastic myself appreciate that let's get into your reading we're going to do aries taurus right now we'll start off the zodiac fresh and clean you know what i mean okay so you know how i do it if you're new to this channel just stick around to the end and see how i put it all together for you okay so i want to pull these first two cards and then we'll get into your story okay see what's going on with you all today yeah almost thanksgiving right holy this this year went by really fast <laughs> kind of crazy yeah it surely did okay so a couple more shuffles and then we'll get right into it all right one more and let's do it all right you ready okay here's your first card Nine of Wands. All right, not too bad. That's overcoming obstacles, okay? Challenges, putting things behind you, all right? Let's get that second card and then we'll get right into the story. Let's see what we got here. 10 of Pentacles. Okay. So this could be something to do with family. You're kind of challenged by someone or somebody or a few in your family. Ten of Pentacles, Nine of Wands. Okay. You're still, um, you know, strong enough to fight the battle. Put some things behind you. Maybe you had some arguments, some disagreements, things like that. Um, yeah. Definitely... Um, Putting some things behind you so maybe you guys did have a fight like i said and and you're just kind of trying to put all that behind you and and still have this you know structured happy family life kind of thing going on right let's see we'll get to the first card of your story and, and knock this out whoop yeah okay yep see you are that wounded warrior you're being the bigger person you're, you're giving this a little better balance, a little better even give and take. That's why you're putting things behind you when it comes to your family, okay? You're the one giving balance here. You're the one making this an even give and take. So it's like kind of like, almost like the peacemaker, in a sense. Seven of Cups. Okay, so noobs, the roles could be reversed and the energies could be switched. This, with the Seven of Cups, is kind of a little bit of confusion, right? A little bit of confused on how to bring this balance to your family life. Putting the barriers and, you know, obstacles behind you. Okay. So this could either be a message coming in. I think it definitely is a message coming in because you're confused on how to do this so let's see what this message is going to be comes in pretty quick too okay so comes in about justice okay so what i see here is that you definitely have somebody that tells you something kind of you know quickly <coughs> and it kind of brings this confusion to an end because the justice card with the seven of cups it's confusion and basically justice is the verdict it's the finale you know what i mean so justice is pretty self-explanatory but it it brings helps you bring balance right so whoever says something to you um send you message text message maybe you reach out to somebody else and they you know kind of respond with some advice options right seven of cups is options um it gives you justice so i think you definitely bring balance to your family life and you're able to put things behind you okay let's see what we got now empress nice justice and the empress that's very <laughs> A beautiful little pair there right 
Okay, so Empress is nurturing. Unconditional love. I mean, what you have for your family, you you know, you love your family unconditionally. You know, you're trying to nurture the situation, find that balance to end the confusion, right? Right? There's your victory. Yep. So you have to be this higher vibing person, right? So let's just say in terms like this wounded warrior here now, once he gets a message on how to really end the confusion of bringing the balance to your family life and putting those blockages behind you, you have to do it in this loving sense, in this nurturing sense. It's very grounded. So, you know, you're raising your vibrations, taking obviously the high road into really bringing this victory towards your you and your family, right? Now, like I said, when the roles are reversed or the energies can be switched, this could be someone that's in your family doing this or you doing this to the family. But I feel it's you, okay? Page of Pentacles. Bring in the peace offering, right? Page of Pentacles. That's you bringing the offer, offer of peace, of victory, of success to but it's a nurturing sense it's it's very kind it's very loving it's very uh, a, a very balanced and grounding kind of offer like a peace offering pretty much <laughs> can't say it any other way right and it's like hey we're a family that's all we got to invest in each other seven of wands uh, seven of pentacles yeah it's like you have you're bringing this It's like you're relaying the message, okay? So the advice that you probably got, which is through this Eight of Wands, which is that message coming in fast. Um, you're saying, hey, you know, we're a family. We're a unit. We're supposed to get past things together and balanced and even and not be all confused and kind of at sorts with each other, okay? So this is kind of how you play the role as the Empress and bring this peace to your family to all invest, right? Invest in options of ways to get around things and to fix things, okay? Settle things. Interesting. Yeah. It's kind of like you're saying that you don't, let's not invest in the hurt, let's not invest in the pain, the heartbreak, you know, we, we're a family. We're not supposed to be at odds with each other and confused and all that, right? We're all supposed to be together and tight and balanced, okay? Wow, this is kind of an interesting message. Let's keep going. Or maybe they all changed their minds. Five of Swords. Like, you're willing to, to work at this at all costs. Whoop. <laughs> Yeah, you're like, let's, let's, let's not, you'd rather keep investing in the, the family to have everybody put their differences and, and blockages behind them and not really, you know, invest in the hurt, but take all costs to change the way that is because threes are about, you know, um, exploration. Swords is your mind, okay? So you're like, I don't care what this takes, we're gonna solve it, right? Whatever that issue is for you guys and your family. I mean, it's not gonna relate to everybody, but everybody's got family issues some point down the line, right? So this is a pretty good message that, you know, I mean, being the peacekeeper, trying to bring that balance is not that easy most times. It's really not. Okay, so there it is. Page of Cups. It's like... The advice that you got, right? The advice that you got made you feel in this high vibe of the Empress to really 
change at all costs the way the investment has been for the family, which has been nothing but barriers, blockages, confusion, things like that. All right. So you have to fight to 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 really change this uh, hurt that's going on. Right. There will be sacrifices with that seven of pentacles. There is a sacrifice there. Right. But it's like the advice that you got was to just to fight for each other not against each other okay and there's your chariot forward <laughs> forward movement like you're gonna keep going like, like you're like okay let's just settle our differences let's just move on let's just love each other as a family unit stop the confusion stop the hurt stop all the things that are blocking us to really be you know a successful happy family right very interesting about the family message. All right, let's get to the outcome here because that was the last card of your story with the chariot, which is a very nice card to end off with. Here is your first card. All right, let me smooth. Boom. You guys are going to move past this pretty smoothly as long as you keep willing to fight for justice and not the heartbreak. Okay? Not the hurt. Which makes total sense. All right, here comes your last card. Are you ready? There it is. Page of Wands. <coughs> well. Maybe it had to do with something with a move. Maybe there was a message about you had to move, okay? Maybe you, there was some conflict with that. Maybe you had to change locations, right? Because there's a message coming in that's, that's... I feel something about moving, right? Moving along. Because you have the chariot and the six of, six of swords. So maybe some of y'all have to relocate. In the places that you're trying to find, uh, you guys are going at each other because... Maybe some of you did want to go there. Some of you didn't want to go there. But you have to be the peacekeeper. You know what I mean? As the head of the household, pretty much. And really say, hey, you know, our investment in this new, in this move will be victorious. Because what's the sense of fighting over something that could bring, a, you know, some good change to us? And, and instead of focusing on the hurt, let's put our differences aside and move forward successfully. And I, I really feel you guys are going to be, some of y'all going to be moving. And that was the whole, that was the whole blockage here. Let's keep going. I'll pull one more card. Yeah, see, boom. You bring the, you, you, you bring them all together. That's unity. That's, you know, coming together. I mean, that's relationship. But choose our choices. It's an emotional choice about, hey, let's pull it together. We can do this because we're a family that should be investing in ourselves and not fighting against each other and hurting each other. Okay? That's too confusing. That brings no balance to the family situation. And if we want victory and success, we got to really pull together and do this move. I, I just really feel it's about a move. Okay? Now, if it's not a move, it's just regular obstacles and things that get in our way normally through, you know, family. Because not everybody's opinion is going to, you know, match. And so, you put the message of unity to, to smoothly get away from the conflict and the hurt. And really look at the investment of a family unit. That's the coming together. That's the unity. That's the Six of Swords moving slowly and smoothly through to calmer waters right so you you relay this message and say okay let's settle our differences let's move to calmer waters and we'll you know reunite together as a whole to bring back our structure bring back our family unit is solid and stable not hurt and confused and, and fighting each other yeah that's what they really have for you well, well look at that he's cups on the bottom 
Well, good luck. It looks like it pays off. You guys do good, but you know, being the empress, raising your vibrations to take the higher road really brings justice to your family situation. And um, I'm glad that it worked out here. I just hopefully, if it hasn't happened yet, you took this this message and can apply it to your life some way, and it will work out for you all. Okay. So binge my playlist. Check everything else I got. You want to enjoy the rest of your week. Um, happy Thanksgiving, my friends. See you again.